Hey guys, I'm Tech, and welcome back to another Forza Horizon 2 video. Now, today's video, what we are going to be doing for today's video rather, is I am going to be showing you some of my favourite glitch places in Forza Horizon 2 for the Xbox 360. Now, a few of these are mostly Xbox 360 exclusives, and you do need a few cars for these. So if we go to my cars. I have quite a lot of them. So you're mostly going to need these two cars. Which is, uh, in fact, we'll just go all S2. You'll need this car from one of them as well, but I'll get onto that one later in this video. But for this, most of the cars you'll need are the um, Huracan LP610-4 fully upgraded, or the Nissan GCR fully upgraded. Now, uh, we're near one at the moment, so let's just change into the Lamborghini. I'm trying to do this all in one take, by the way, so, um, <laughs> yeah, this is going to be fun. Still, here we are. There we go, got our nice Lamborghini here. The first glitch location is going to be over here, at St. Martin Airport. It's actually how to get over to this bit. So let's go and travel there now. But there's also another one around there. Come on. This thing is fast. I missed my turn off. Ouch. If I had cosmetic damage on for this game, that would be very painful and very expensive. Believe me, it would be very expensive at the least. So, around this corner here. You know what, let's just go off road. Because it's Forza, we can do that. There's also another glitch there, by the way. Ow! What was... Okay, there's an invisible wall for no reason. Brilliant. Love it. So, what I'm going to be showing you today on one of these glitched areas is how to get to there. Because out here, there's no way through, you can't get through these gates. So, what you want to do is you want to follow the thing that I'm doing on screen now, and that's going to the airport. So, we should be approaching that entrance in a few seconds, if I don't miss it, like I usually do. Right, let's start breaking. Now, missed it, like usual. And there we go, so here. Now, if I can do this first time, this is going to be incredible. This usually does take a few attempts because you want to hit this jump just over here at just the right spot. I think we've done it. Have we done it? Yes, we have. We have done it. Land it, land it, land it. There we go. If all goes well, we should end up hitting that tree. Now it can go off this way. Where you can get from here. This is where I am. By the way, that's my car. You can get all the way over to here. And here. So you can get quite a fair way. Anywhere after here, you end up um, yeah, English. You end up falling through the map. So the bit that we want to do is we want to turn left. And you can just go through all these trees, not doing that and hitting them. Now, now there's things in my way. Come on, there we go. So you just want to go along this wall. That's a tree, not a wall. There's more trees. I don't know which is one of us. Now this bit you'll want to be very careful with because after you go through here, you cannot go through this wall. Otherwise, see, your car just goes out through the other side. And trust me, we don't want that. All we want to do is keep going straight across. So just fly along here and don't do that. Because that would be very bad. Come on, Huracan LP610-4 with its really long name. Now there are cones there, which makes me think they were planning something with this. That's a tree. Now once you get along here, follow the route that I'm taking, that's turning right across here. You can make this in the GTR that I showed you as well, and in a Bugatti Veyron, because me and a mate actually did that. You know, about a while back on Free Roam. 
you want to see a few online free driving videos, let me know in the comments and I'll see what I can do. So, so you're driving along here, it should come to somewhere like this. And what we're after is going to the edge of this wall here. And there we go. Go along here. And now we're on this drift road. And see, that's the spot that we were trying to get through before. Now you can go quite a fair way on this road, but you can't go infinitely. Because, well, I'll show you. There you go. You can go over to, I think, I need to put the brakes on here. This is about as far as you can go. So if you go through here, well, that'll happen. I think we'll just fall into the void of Forza. See? Then we'll end up back out over here. And then we'll probably end up doing that. Nope. That was a huge fail. And to get out of here, all you need to do is just shoot through this wall, and there you go. So, that is the first glitch, that is the out of map over here. So, I'm going to go get another bit for the next glitch, another glitched area, and I will be back once I've done that. But I need to set everybody back here. So, I'll be back with another car for our next glitch spot. Okay, well, I did say I was going to go and get another... Out to fail. Well, I did say I was going to go and get another car, but I've just come across another glitch spot that you can also try. This one, I believe, is better on Xbox One, but you want to take this sort of... That sort of route. This one does take a few tries and cannot be done on the first attempt. Believe me, I've tried it a lot of times recently. Still, it can be done. I watched someone called AR12 for that, AR12 Gaming. He managed to do that with a push something or other. But that's a little bit that I wanted to show you. Okay, and hey look, we're back where we started. Now I need the garage. Go back down to S2. There it is. Come on. Right. Yes, this is a Fiat 595. Fully upgraded S2 again. I believe it's across here. Did I just go through the tree? Okay. Well, I just did that. But here is your next spot. And that is just here at St. Martin. You want to be here on the map, where my arrow is. And when you get there, you'll see something like this. What you want to do is just drive through there. This can only be done, as far as I know, in the 595. I'm not actually sure how far you can get, so I only discovered this one last night. That, well, it looks like you can actually get quite a fair way across. So if you want to confuse your mates, I know I'll be trying this 
when the Motor Mine goes online tonight. <laughs> oh man, I can't wait. I can't wait to see his face. <laughs> okay, the trees are still mapped. We need to remember that. If I'm correct, you can't go through. No, you can't go through those. Still, that's another one of the glitch spots. So get out, just drive down here, and there you go. So, I'm going to go and find another one of them. I've lost count of how many there is. I think that's about three so far. Yeah. Well, two successful runs, one attempt. And yes, my car did just still be... Still, I'm going to go and get a car, and I will see you at the next glitch spot. Alright, so I'm back with the next glitch spot. I went and got a fully upgraded GTR because you will need that car to this. What you want to do is you see this wall here, just there. Hang on. That one. This is also backed by St. Martin Airport. What you want to do is you want to stop about here and then just gradually keep going on the accelerator. Short little burst until eventually you get through here. It does take a while, it, and it cannot be done first try as proved there. It does take me a while to do a few of these. Plus, I think it's turning tonight. There, you have to be super, super careful on the throttle. So just short, sharp inputs. Apart from when you get to here. Then it's a case of floor it until it eventually lets you through. Come on. Now, I know for sure this does work, because I have done it before. This is after the game was updated. Come on. So close to making it. So close to making it. I want to make this on camera so I can show you guys it is possible. Come on. Ah, oh, this is frustrating me. Why isn't it let me do it? Come on. So I guess this is possible. And just to prove most of the glitches are possible. I'm actually doing Okay, well I wasn't expecting this to happen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh. But, um, basically, as I'm trying to prove to you these glitches are possible, I'm doing these whilst, well, ah, English. I'm doing these all in one take, I'm not editing these clips, apart from intro, outro, and various things saying which glitch it is. I wonder if we can get through here this way, no. But I am saying you guys, this one is possible, it does take quite a lot of practice to do it. So I'm going to go ahead and try and see if I can do it again. If not, then we will move on to the next glitch. Come on. Oh, I'm getting so close each time. So close. Come on. Yes! Finally! There we go. See guys, I told you it was possible. And indeed, you do fall through the map if you go too far back. That was there. Yay! Still, it is possible, and you can go quite a fair way along here. Like I am doing now. Yes, you can drive underwater if you wish. And I do believe you can hill climb as well. This is like Forza Horizon 2 proper off-road spot. In fact, while we're here, I'm going to take a photo of this. There we go. So, I'm just going to call this uh, Nissan Hill Climb so you guys can find it easily. There we go, Nissan Hill Climb. Saving content, please don't turn off your console, because if you do, we'll find it and we will turn it back on again. 
There you go, so that's the thing. There we go, uploading photo, please wait. This is pretty, this is basically what that photo will look like, so you guys can go and find it on Horizon 2 storefront. And let's go move on to the next glitch. Which actually is handily right over here. There's a lot of glitch spots in here. I'm going to have to go back and count these all up because I've actually lost count. So anyway, here is basically where you can make your car a train if you wish. You can't go too far across. You can get a fair way down here. So I came along here with the Subaru BRZ not too long ago. In fact, I do have a photo of it here. I've got to try and find it now. I've taken quite a lot. There it is. In fact, there's a few more that I've taken. Now it's done doing the same glitch. See? I've made my car into a train. There is another one as well. There's actually quite a lot for 360 version. And I think the last one for today, we're going to go over somewhere to here. I believe it's along here somewhere. So this is going to be quite a long drive for me, but for you guys, you'll see it in the next couple of, of seconds. Okay, so apparently just got a message saying I have 12,500 credits to collect. Okay. Anyway, we are 1.9 miles away from the destination. That's a tree. Anyway, we are 1.8 miles now from the destination. And that's another tree! Still. This is a fun glitch because I don't think anyone's made a video on this particular one. Yes, I have. I stand corrected. But as far as I know, I'm the, one of the first people to make the video on this particular spot. It's not too far away from here now. It's in the top right corner of the map. So you have to travel quite a fair way. And as far as I know from experience, it has to be the fully upgraded 1000 horsepower monster of a GTR. So we're 0.6 miles away from it. And I've done quite a drift there. Wow. So we are coming up to it now. Come on, boot it! Can we get to 200 before? No, we can't break. It is just here, by the way. It's how to get over there. Seems impossible, right? You know, there's the horizon barriers that mean you can't get past. Not as impossible as you think. You see, going on here, it'll be this. Now, again, ideally you want to stop about here, and then the short, sharp throttle movements just gradually accelerating every five seconds or so, just whatever it is you can get your car to keep going on the move. Now, again, this is another one that does take a while to perfect. This one certainly took me, I don't know how many tries. And this one I'm actually recording live as, as so such ah oh, come on I am like I'm recording this by the way there we go and we are through not a graceful entry as such but right once you get onto this road you do not want to go off it trust me if you do that you end up falling through the world yes I know Forza logic Forza logic strikes again along with force of physics. Still, what you want to do is you, it's just a small little road you can drive along. This is an Xbox 360 exclusive kind of glitch, really. Like this one I know for sure you cannot do on Xbox One because you'll be going into the Montalino car meet. And as you see here, we're quite a fair way... Yeah, quite a fair way. This is where it is by the way if you want to see it's just here you'll be looking for a house with some horizon barriers and if you're on the xbox one i'm sorry but you can't do uh, this particular glitch 
The rest I don't really know about. That was close. But um, yeah, you can go and try a few of the others. If you do those, let me know. That'd be pretty cool to hear if you've done a few of these. So, you'll just be looking for a house and a few horizon barriers. I can't even get through there. There we go. This is what you'll be looking for. Go through the wall over there. And then you can drive all the way along. It's actually a really cool glitch. But I think that will round it off for today's video. So, hope you all enjoyed. And yes, go ahead and try a few of these. Trust me, they're good fun. And they really confuse a few people in online if they don't know how to do it. I know, I did that to a friend of mine. I had no clue how I got there until I actually showed him. It was actually quite funny. But still, thank you for watching. If you do a few of these, and if you find any more glitches, let me know in the comments. And until my next video, goodbye.